Hello there, I'm of course John Doe right here in Tokyo, Japan. Uh, we're going to do another edition of the Ghost Hunters report. Now we may call this special comments or commentary, but watch your will. This is not your normal like news thing, uh, break down some news thing and get a perspective on it, and it's not really a comment or talk video either. What I want to talk about is given this popularity of Bernie Sanders in America, and this social democrat concept becoming more in people's minds consciously in the United States. I thought I've seen a lot of conversation about social democrats and are they really socialist? Well, when I look at this, I, I think yes and no. Let's look at why we want we might say yes they are socialist. Well, they do believe in economic rights, that all people have economic rights. They do believe in redistribution of wealth. They do believe in um, thing, concepts such as a use value and labor being the foundation of a society. They believe in these type of things. They believe in a lot of um, social programs for uh, working people. They believe in all these type of things. You know, which I say are good, and nothing inherently wrong or bad about these things. Yeah. But let's kind of look at why they're not socialist. First point and biggest point is that social democrats are not based on Marxism. They're based on reformism. They're not interested at all in uh, getting rid of capitalism or having a revolution or overthrowing a capitalist class and replacing them with a proletariat dictatorship. They have no interest in that. That's not their point. Not what they're trying to do. Maybe I'm being a little crass when I say this, but the main objective of social democrats is kind of create a softer, happy version of capitalism where everybody gets, um, gets, some, gets benefit from it, not just one small group of people we know as a capitalist class. So yeah, so that's the basics of it. You know, yes, they are socialists, and no, they are not socialist. Now, can social democracy really solve major contradictions within a capitalist system through reform? No, it cannot. And then again, that's not the point or objective of social democrats. They do not, they're not interested in major contradictions. They're interested, interested in reform. Smaller contradictions, smaller things. They kind of want to get capitalism under control through a lot of regulation, like I said, a lot of social programs, a lot of more um, what they call redistribution of wealth. Now, where does this go wrong? Where does this uh, kind of fail to really get something major accomplished in society? Where does it fail to push this human society forward in a really radical, revolutionary way? What it comes down to is social democrats are not really um, internationalist. They don't have an international perspective oftentimes in our modern con uh, concept of social democrats. They focus a lot on just the country they're in. Getting more benefits for the people who live there. You know, while having, often having no problem with other countries, people in other regions being exploited or wars of aggression, as long as those things benefit the people in their own country. Now you'll find social democrats are very anti-war, yes you will. You'll find uh, social democrats who do take a stance against exploitation uh, economically. But it's not an overall thing. They don't really stick to this as closely as, I've, as some say. You know. So. To wrap this up, because I didn't want to make it very long, I just want to make some short comments on it. The Social Democrats are socialist in a sense that they wish to make capitalism a bit softer, which is kind of funny, and have a lot of reforms and benefit people who live in the country that they are in. But while outside the country, they really don't care what happens as much as they do what's inside their own country. And point two is, always remember, they're not Marxist. They're not communist. They do not uphold the ideas of revolution. 
or pushing for it or organizing for it. They're still in service of the bourgeois capitalist class and they're still looking to maintain that social order. But I want to hear what you guys think about this in the comment box below. First time you see me, subscribe. Get to know old John Dole, at least here through some videos. As I've got quite a few uploaded now and there's a bit of an archive for you to check out. So you can have a lot of viewing there. Um, as always, this is me, John Dole, here in Tokyo. Check it out.